We need to talk. Your bat mitzvah is in two weeks' time. We planned everything for this occasion. The rabbi, the guests, the food, the wine. We're so proud of you, our only child. You, you studied so hard to learn the Torah. You, you're going to perform in the synagogue with style. Then we'll <laughs> celebrate with a hora. <laughs> Mom, Dad, I have something to confess. I know you love me and you mean well, but I don't want to be Jewish, I guess. <laughs> I want to be Christian. <laughs> I can't the bells. What are you joking? Is this a prank? You want to be Christian? That's absurd. You're Jewish, Rachel. That's not a blank you can fill with any one faith or word. Oh, Rachel. Oh, don't say such things. You're your words are breaking our hearts. With that choice, you don't know what it will bring. Rachel, you'll lose your heritage and your voice. I'm sorry to hurt you, but I've been reading a book written by Gentiles. It tells me of love. It's pure and true. It makes me feel happy and worthwhile. Rachel, how could you believe that? How could you accept that God has a a son. That's blasphemy, Rachel. It's a fact. There's only one God, and he's the one. Rachel, listen to us. We know best. We've been there before, you see. We were once young like you. We wanted to explore and be free. That is when we, we discovered our roots, when we discovered our history, when we discovered our ancestors and fruits, when we discovered Destiny. <sighs> Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> we learned of Joseph. <laughs> Dad, I've missed 
you so much. I'm sorry to have made you sad. I'm sorry that I lost touch. Rachel, we're just grateful to see you. We were worried sick. We didn't know what to do. We didn't know what to think. Rachel, we're so happy that you're back. We've been praying so hard. We're worried that you wouldn't hear nor regard. Mom, Dad, I've heard your prayers. I felt your love. But I had my own affairs of which to think of. <laughs> Look! I've got stigma! <laughs> I've been working hard at the church to make frittatas. <laughs> Rachel, that's not funny. That's disrespectful and rude. You're mocking our faith and our joy. You're being ungrateful and crude. Mom, Dad, I'm sorry. I will be subdued. I didn't mean to offend. I only wanted to lighten the mood. I only want to be your friend. Rachel, we don't need your jokes. They don't land with us old folks. Mom! Dad! <laughs> I'm being honest. I'm being loyal. But not to you! Or to Judaism. But to myself. And to Christianity. <laughs> Rachel, how could you believe that? How could you betray us like this? How could you turn your back on your family? How could you forsake your promise? Rachel, do you remember what's next week? Do you remember what we've agreed upon? Do you remember what we've prepared for? Do you remember what it means to be a Jew? Mom! Dad! I remember everything. But I don't want to do it anymore! I don't want to have a bat mitzvah because I don't want to be Jewish anymore! <laughs> then leave and, and don't come back to me! Is upon 
upon us. It was said that the death of the prophet's father would signify the end of times. Oh, my feeble little pacemaker! Can't take the form of this! <laughs> <laughs>